Great White Shark Great White Shark is the last animal you'd want to encounter swimming in the ocean. They're large and fast hunters who have keen enough senses to allow them to rule the ocean as apex predators. Don't let their size fool you, Great White Sharks are incredibly stealthy predators that have mastered the art of efficient killing. With a mouth full of 300 3-inch teeth that will always regrow when damaged, the Great White Shark will eat anything and everything it can get its mouth on. While shark movies have conditioned us to believe that Great White Sharks are ruthless sea murderers, they don't actively search for unsuspecting swimmers. There's a 1 in 4.3 million chance of getting killed by a great white shark. Instead, these sharks prefer to eat seals, sea lions, fish, and other sharks. They can smell their prey from miles away, meaning that as long as there's another fish in the sea, people don't have to worry about a great white shark suddenly turning the beach into a buffet. Killer whale, orca. They may look like fish, but they're actually just mammals. They're not even whales, but are closer to dolphins. At about 30 feet long, they are the largest giant apex predators on Earth, making them the uncontested king of the waters. As creatures on top of the food chain, orcas live on a diverse diet that includes fish, seals, sea lions, and even other whales. They're intelligent animals with herding instincts that allow them to group and hunt in packs, often displaying incredible teamwork. These whales are so big and terrifying for other sea creatures that even great white sharks have been observed to flee once an orca invades their territory. But as fearsome as orcas may be, they're not threats to humans. There have been no recorded cases of a killer whale attacking humans in the wild. In fact, in Norway, orcas are so uninterested in eating humans that people often swim near these sea predators. Tiger Shark You'd need two Shaquille O'Neals stacked on top of each other to form the length of a tiger shark, which can be around 14 feet long. But their size isn't just for show, because these predators aren't picky eaters. They are second only to the great white shark in aggression, making them ruthless and voracious eaters. Tiger sharks are apex predators that have no natural predators in the sea. They're opportunistic eaters, nicknamed the ocean's garbage can because they eat almost anything from turtles, fish, and seals. While they don't have the longest teeth at just over an inch long, they are serrated and can cut through anything when paired with the tiger shark's mighty jaw. Tiger sharks are solitary hunters, which means they rarely hunt in groups. If you do spot a tiger shark, you don't have to worry too much, because they don't often see humans as food. Sperm Whale As the ocean's heavyweight champions of the oceans, sperm whales are the largest toothed predators on Earth, at 50 to 60 feet long and 45 to 60 tons heavy. But these whales aren't big and clumsy hunters. Instead, they are incredibly smart. Known to live in groups, sperm whales have mastered the art of teamwork, like a group of Navy commandos. They use echolocation, nature's high-tech sonar system, to track down their prey and communicate with one another. Through this hunting method, they can thrive as predators as deep as around 4,000 feet. They are the only creatures known to eat giant squids at those depths, which are too big for other sea predators to hunt down. Sperm whales are also known to have matriarchal systems where the oldest females take the lead in navigation and decision-making. But while sperm whales may be the biggest predators in the seas, the smaller killer whales have been known to attack them. Of course, sperm whales aren't docile creatures as well. They are known to attack ships occasionally and even sink them. Bull Shark The bull shark is among the most aggressive predators in the oceans, along with the great white shark and the tiger shark. It is distinguished by its chunkier build, but what makes it unique is its versatility. Bull sharks are known for being quite the traveler, because they can swim in fresh and saltwater environments. So if you see a big shark in a river or a lake, it's probably a bull shark. Speaking of size, bull sharks can reach up to 11 feet in length, making them big and intimidating enough for most sea creatures. They're not too particular with their food, as they are known to eat fish, dolphins, and smaller sharks. With the strongest bite force in the shark family, pound for pound, bull sharks can bite through skin, flesh, and bone faster than any other shark, including the much bigger great white shark. Shark. While rare, bull shark attacks account for many unprovoked shark attacks on humans. They're not generally aggressive toward humans, but it's best to keep your distance from these dangerous meat-crunching machines. Hammerhead Shark Easily distinguishable due to its T-shaped head, the hammerhead shark may look like an oddball, but there's a good reason why they have heads shaped like a hammer. Scientists believe that hammerhead sharks evolved to have wide-set eyes that give them a wider view of their surroundings. Think of them as having a panoramic view of their environment at all times. On top of that, they have nostrils that are large enough to smell prey from miles away. It's like their heads give them built-in radars that help make them some of the most efficient predators in the sea. Found in warm waters worldwide, hammerhead sharks can vary in size depending on their type. The great hammerhead shark, at 20 feet long, can rival the size of a great white
white shark. Meanwhile, most hammerhead sharks are around the size of a small car. While they are big, hammerhead sharks are generally safer than most sharks. Since 1900, there have only been 16 recorded hammerhead attacks on humans, none of which were lethal. Goblin Shark Think of the goblin shark as the weird cousin of the shark family, because he always ruins family photos with that disturbing face. This sea predator has a face that only a mother could love, and we're not even exaggerating when we say that it's one of the ugliest and most terrifying creatures found in the sea. Fortunately, you're unlikely to encounter these predators because the goblin shark prefers to hang out in the ocean's dark depths. They can be found more than 4,000 feet underwater, a depth only submarines can reach. They likely evolved to look this way because of the intense pressure of their deep habitat. But while they don't look like conventional sharks, they're just as big, measuring up to 13 feet long. Due to the rarity of large predators in the deep seas, goblin sharks are probably apex predators, feeding on a wide variety of deep sea creatures, including bony fish, cephalopods, and crustaceans. If their faces aren't horrifying enough, these sharks have elongated jaws that can protrude forward to capture prey like an extension claw. Saltwater Crocodile At an average size of 17 feet long, these guys are the closest we'll ever get to real-life dinosaurs. Found in the wilds of Australia and Southeast Asia, saltwater crocodiles are the largest predatory reptiles in the world, making them the scariest animals that can swim in water and walk on land. They are primarily found in rivers and estuaries and are known as ambush predators. They often lurk in the water until an unsuspecting mammal finds itself close to the croc. When its prey is close enough, the huge reptile can strike quickly and crush through the animal's bones. The saltwater crocodile has the strongest bite force at 3,700 pounds per square inch. You only need a bite force of around 200 PSI to tear through a steak. You can just imagine what kind of damage 3,700 PSI can do. It's like getting caught in a steel trap when this croc shuts its mouth. Saltwater crocs are also incredibly fast in the water, capable of swimming and running up to 18 miles per hour. Coupled with their powerful jaws, these predators are built for the kill. They are the ultimate land and sea hunters. You must also keep your distance from them, because there have been roughly 100 saltwater crocodile attacks on humans since the 1970s. Giant Squid Sailor legends talk of sea beasts the size of a kraken. The giant squid is a sci-fi movie creature with a 40-foot body the length of a school bus and tentacles that look like colossal noodles. The giant squid, however, tends to be a rare sighting because it usually lives in depths of at least 3,200 feet, where it is a top predator. It has the largest eyes in the world, allowing it to detect its prey deep underwater. With sharp beaks that can slice through almost anything, these elusive creatures are voracious predators that eat any deep-sea fish smaller than it. The only underwater creature not on the menu is the bigger and stronger sperm whale, the only known predator of the giant squid. However, scientists know little about these enigmatic predators due to the rarity of giant squid sightings. Most of our knowledge about them is based on their smaller counterparts. Leopard Seal Whenever the leopard seal isn't ripping baby penguins into half, it probably puts smaller fish on the endangered list. So there's a reason it sits at the top of the food chain. The leopard seal is also much bigger than the regular sea lion, measuring up to 11 feet long and weighing around 1,000 pounds. On top of their size, these predators have faces that make them look like reptiles, especially with the rows of sharp teeth made for slicing through flesh like a hot knife on butter. Leopard seals are the apex predators of the Antarctic because the only creatures known to eat them are the orcas. But when they're on land, leopard seals are the undisputed kings of the ice, eating any animal they can find, including penguins, birds, and even their smaller seal cousins. However, they tend to be solitary and territorial animals that won't hesitate to defend their territory. Leopard seal attacks on humans are rare, but not impossible, with one recorded fatality. While that may be true, there are times when they exhibit the same playfulness as their sea lion counterparts, interacting with divers and even playing with penguins. Now that's playing with your food. Mako Shark The Mako Shark was made to be the Ferrari of the oceans. It's the Michael Phelps of the shark family, because this predator can swim faster than any other shark. So if the great white shark were Superman, then the Mako Shark would undoubtedly be the Flash. The long, pointy, and sleek Mako Shark can swim up to 45 miles per hour. Their crescent-shaped tails help them reach incredible underwater speeds. Mako Sharks aren't small sharks because they can grow up to 15 feet. With their physical tools, Mako Sharks can hunt down any prey, including squids, marine mammals, tuna, and smaller sharks. 
dogs. They are apex predators in their territories, but unlike their larger shark counterparts, they have shorter teeth that aren't serrated because they mainly feed on fish. Mako shark attacks on humans are rare, but because of their speed and aggressive nature, they are classified as too dangerous to approach at sea. Scientists struggle to study these sharks in captivity and the wild. Blue Marlin At 14 feet long and over 2,000 pounds, the blue marlin is a large fish that combines size, beauty, and speed in a strikingly blue package. But while they may be big, they are also some of the fastest fish in the world. The blue marlin can reach speeds of up to 80 miles per hour, right up there with the sailfish in terms of the fastest fish in the sea. They use their speed and other physical capabilities to hunt down entire schools of fish. Blue marlins are the sushi masters of the sea because they use their pointed snouts to methodically slash their way through tuna, mackerel, and squid before consuming them. Nature gave them a sword and they made sure to use it. Thank you.